All right, to continue our game. We are still King O'Donnell. The third, though, the Flayer of Asturias. Hmm, the Flayer? We're slowly flayed to death. We're cruel. Hmm, all right. We're the Flayer. So, uh, a chunk of land is missing. That should belong to us. Our... Hang on, wait a minute. Uh, you not, you're not really anything. I mean, you're kind of family, but you're not really family. You, like, we're over here somewhere and... You know, um, there you go. There we are, in all our glory. We are leading troops. Maybe we don't want to do that. Or do we want to do that? I guess it doesn't really matter. We're on Primo, so... Who cares? At this point, we're no longer getting the El Cid line, unfortunately, because... Well, uh, you need several wars, and there's just not enough land, and we, we're just going to finish this off now. Um, well, the task of reconquering Iberia, that's where we're going to finish off. We might play on. Uh, this guy hates our guts, of course, because he wants lots of land. Um, we've got our troops raised. We're getting raided, but... Not anymore, I guess. So let's just put these down. Boats are... Where are they? Um, I don't know. There's somewhere. Incoming one. Hmm, it's a ghost ship. Whatever. Let's put it down. There you go. Alright. Whole bunch of issues. Are we at war? No, we're not. Alright, Pope. Let's... Uh, we're on free investiture. Alright, Pope. You know the deal. Repair, reconquer this war. We can do that. Get a few troops. We do have a truce though. Yeah, we got a pretty long truce. Alright, can we hurry this up? We're known as the Flayer. We're up to no good, so... Oh god. Alright, you're not gonna last. Kind of. Hopefully. Hopefully people... Mm, you kind of liked. Why do they like you? Well, it's only barely. Decreased council power, dislikes new obligation law. Sold vassal county, oh dear. Who's the odd one out? <laughs> who's, who's the guy who received some stuff for free? Uh, it, it will probably be under his... If he was getting raided and he gave out some land... Wait, sold some land? Or was it burger land? Burger land. Um, whatever. I don't think we care. Um, <laughs> only the Pope is fit to crown me. Yep. It's old Vassal County. Yeah, he, he's... He's sold something to a raider somewhere. I can, I'm sure we, if we spend some effort we could find him, but whatever. We can seek this guy's opinion and lower our... What is wrong with you? You're not very smart, are you? We can lower our work or we can become stressed. Alright, let's become stressed. I guess there's no point in prepare, hitting this button, preparing a reconquest war, because we won't be able to declare war. That would be bad. Alright, Pope. Ah, oh, of course, Papal Investiture. Oh, of course, yeah, sure. <laughs> now we're going to have an extravagant ceremony for that ambassador opinion. We've uh, lost our nice helmet. It will never be soon enough. Let's move our troops over to... What is this, actually? Is this just all retinue? I guess it is. Can we get more? Yes, we can. What is it, actually, right now? All right, four Caballeros and two Light Infantry, or whatever it's called. Light Skirmish. For the numbers, I guess. Um, oh, let's get one more, just, just to even it out. We've got three of them, just for numbers. I don't really care about the strength of these uh, retinue, I just want some more numbers. So we look big and scary, so factions aren't a problem. Which, then not really. You want this guy for Astorius, my brother? Alright, yeah, my, mother, my brother, and my other brother, and this brother. Wait, are you double, double, where did, where did your title go to? Like, who, who, who's got this now? Me, I've got it. Oh, wait. All right. Okay, I'm way over the... Of course. Uh, could we be friends? Who's this? Serene Doge, Leonardo the Black. 
He's excommunicated. I'm sure the Pope does not like him being there, but uh, let's be friends. You've not got a whole lot of money, but you're making more, so whatever. Excellent. I've made a friend. All right, we had an ambition as well. Good. And uh, no more ambitions to choose. We're too prestigious, I guess. We're too rich. Uh, we've got too much piety as well, so we can't become paragons of virtue or exalted upon men or build a war chest or anything like that. Maybe we'll just waste our money then, so we can can choose it just just because. Uh, we've got high diplomacy. What is our? Ooh, we've got a lot of martial. All right. Well, I hate you too. And he has come to the conclusion that I am an ungrateful hypocrite. All right. Well, whatever. Let's talk him out of it. You there? Uh, who are you? My cousin. All right. You can be uh, diplomatic. Oh, the Vasilema. Designated regent. I guess my uh, homosexual wife can do that. Can be that even. There you go. You're the regent. Got a lower fertility there. Hmm. Italian. Right. You're the daughter of a patrician. Fat, uncouth one. <laughs> Cousin. Why? Who's all these people? Look. You decide for yourselves, okay? Oh, my... I can imprison a blind Jewish guy who wants to murder some Khazar Orthodox guy. You have money? You've got money. All right, wait, hang on. Hang on. <laughs> uh, let's suppress revolts. You're not the best. I prefer having people over 20. It's so easy to get that as well because you can just you know, invite... Oh, 27. He hate me if he, yeah, he already hates me because my domains to make and stuff. I think we were umming and eyeing about who to give this land to, and in the end, I guess it doesn't really matter. Wait, what have you got? Uh, what have you got? Right, that. And you're under him. <laughs> what about if we just? And you two need to be done with it. I just can't be bothered with this anymore. Here, have it. Fine. Uh, we're getting raided. Alright. Let's erase up everything. And head over here. Uh, we've got people in our dungeon. A lot of them. Uh, getting piety? Oh, yeah, it's getting piety. Well, that 2,000 mark that we want to reach. Alright, let's just banish everyone. They're not worth any money. I guess we've conquered their lands. Get out of here. Who are you? Whatever, get out of here. I am merciful. Alright. We're crowned. Still a whole bunch of issues still, though. Uh, groom and heir, or see the realm prosper. How old are you? Three. Alright, let's just see the realm prosper first. We'll complete that before we can introduce the heir to the realm and get her. Potentially a few bonuses and stuff. Let's have a look at the laws. We can't change any. We can usurp the title. The Sultanate of... Yeah, we're not going to do that. Uh, that's nice, I guess. We can try and steal some holy relic. Seamless robe of Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Am I educating my son? I think I am. Yes, I am. Um. <sighs> Becoming ambitious would be great, but I don't want to get kicked out. I kind of want to stay in that uh, society a little longer. Maybe next time. To crew the penance, sure. We'll try and become a better person. So we can get the... Uh, get a a bloodline becoming a saint or something. But I think our dad is doing that. Oh, our grandfather even. I think he's already beatified, yes. There's a good chance we might become a saint through him. Well, get a saint bloodline through him. Alright, patron of the relic, blah blah blah. More prestige and stuff. Alright, let's, let's just pile on. Just go. 
who cares about commanders and stuff. Let's uh, raise the troops if they run, but they didn't. We'll become erudite or whatever. Uh, no, we didn't. We're not too smart. We're on the borderline of being able to draw, <laughs> draw <laughs> write a book. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What if you? <laughs> what if you're under eight intelligence and instead of writing a book, you draw a book? Scroll some images. Because you're too dumb to write. <laughs> so you get a picture book. Uh. Right. We want to arrest you. Yeah. <laughs> get out of here. You must have been our former spy master or something. Popular prestige. Yeah, well, whatever. We've got your money. We'll... Oh, this guy. Oh. Oh. Great post. No? Hang on, wait, what? Over here? Yeah. Fine. We'll head this way. Oh, these guys. Yeah, they're a form. Well, this guy isn't. But these guys are going to be difficult to get rid of. Jihad for Africa. Go arms. Uh oh. Me? How dare you? What is this? Are you... You're Shia. Okay, so this is going to be simpler. Alright, fine. Let's... Let's re-raise, actually. I don't think we need to re-raise, but our vassals will not care anymore that we've got troops raised because we're in a defensive war. Let's have these guys just walk along. Or just meet up there. We'll put you down if we need to. You guys... We've got a lot of ships. Uh... Every time I've chosen this option because of a book in our inventory, it usually just backfires for some reason, even though it says it's supposed to be good. Whatever, let's do it. Uh, yeah, adopt his ideas. In fact, we can move this. All right, we did well. Potentially becoming charitable. Nope. Are you really gonna just land on my troops? Uh, wait until those guys <laughs> arrive here. We are no longer cynical. Catch him! I don't think we will. Nope. Ah, these guys are so annoying. We'll just boat bomb them. We'll get on the boats. And hunt them down. Alright. Oh, look at this. He's created another kingdom. And he made it his primary. Yeah. Right, we can now create the Kingdom of Andalusia. Do we, oh, do we have enough yet? No. Alright, fine. Aha, hello. Yes. Welcome. What are you doing? Trying to fabricate some stuff on me? Who are you? Oh, you're there? I'm not on my domain limit. Can you just stop? I mean, you're the Saeed guy who <laughs> tried to, like, set something up. I'm sure we've already done something somewhere where we might be creating... There you go. Well, he's a bastard. I think it only matters if... If he's not acknowledged. If he, if we don't know who his father is, then he doesn't get the Saeed trait. Because technically, I... Well, whatever. If you know who the father is, I guess he gets to keep the seed trait, even if he's the bastard. Right, everyone's gathering up. Uh, let's try and make my son dull. It's just always going to be like that, right? Uh, let's try and read the Bible. There's a 20% chance of him becoming shrewd. But you only got the idolizer trait, which... <laughs> it's not that great. 
You can become frail, which is terrible. Really dislike that. Stop! No! Lack of power. What, you? Or me? Excuse me? <laughs> what? I could arrest you right now if I wanted to. What are you on about? Lack of power. And he loves me by 100. Maybe he means personal power because he's sturdy. <laughs> I've got 60 per personal combat skill, damn it. This is getting kind of messed up here. Abbasid, I don't like seeing that there. Who is this? Boss? Rata. Hmm, alright. Right, more people are joining them. Okay. What is... Uh, right, secluded penance. We become charitable. Alright, cool. Alright, let's get on the boat. Get over here, let's meet them. Okay, we can get a kitty. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's get intrigue and health for just having a cat. Because the cat tells us stuff. Or it will just hiss fiercely whenever there's... Aha, here we go. When there's a uh, assassin hiding behind the curtains or something. Uh, Saint in Heaven. Blessed Odona II was a true exemplar of the Christian faith, living a pious and moderate life. In a grand announcement, Pope Sergius III has decided to canonize Odono the Understanding. Many tales are told about the saint and the feats he did in life. It was often said that Saint Odono was so understanding of others that he would be able to practically read their minds. Uh, despite his gift, he never used it for evil. Hmm. It was truly, he, and was truly a servant of God, blessing those in his presence. It is a great honor for the family of the blessed saint. We may all aspire to become a pious, uh, as pious as him. Blessed be his name. All right, thank you, Pope. Hmm. Cruel Pope. But yeah, all right. Oh, and we improved our skill we've got a lot of martial what do we actually get out of this then damage to religious enemies <laughs> yes good convert counties to your religion faster and christian church opinion plus five that's pretty good all right is everything on here we can increase here in our rank uh what is this the emperor petro um petro yeah petro Wants to marry my cousin. <laughs> the offspring of the, of the fat, sturdy people. They're both fat and sturdy. Excellent. <laughs> so, uh, hmm. Do we just say yeah to that? Do we care about where you are? Where are you in this line? We've got plenty of brothers. And they're gonna be spitting out. Um, yeah, we've got Matri. Mar uh, no, this she's not Matri married. She's not got a normal marriage. But whatever. We've got a Matri married sister over here. She's not producing any kids. What's wrong with you? But we've got tons of brother. Well, three brothers. We've got a son already. Make kids, damn it! Expand our family. Yeah, we've got our cousin over here in, uh... What do you own? The steel. Why is it... Oh, you're down here? You're over there. What are you doing? You're attacking King Froiler of Crusader Frisia and Castilian Crusader Frisia excommunic Excommunication War. Defending against... Okay, um... That's me. Alright, you... Just... Continue fighting, I guess. We'll just say yes to this. Alright, fine. Create some kind of alliance. So he's probably going to get a claim on our. Uh, no, actually, weak. No, nah, it doesn't matter.
don't think our cousin being married to that guy does anything for us. But for roleplay reasons, I guess it's kind of nice that our family is important enough to uh, have people marry there. Uh, yes, you can be the leader on the right. Maybe I should be on the left. This guy's a center, a direct leader. So we'll just, we'll just sit here. Are you guys actually going to fight? Are you guys coming? Alright, we got promoted. In our society, we can groom an heir. Just do that. We'll sort our vassal stuff out later. It won't be a problem once we have the empire. We get more vassal limit out of that. Yeah, everything looks fine here. Just train our commanders. I just like doing that more now for the marshal, rather than just training troops and stuff. Administer realm just to get everything booming. Oh, where are you? Are you coming? Where exactly are you? You're over here. <laughs> you would have probably achieved more by going for something around here. Like one of these small... Like instead you're like, ah, let's go for Africa. A little far out of the way. Oh god, what's wrong with us now? Our cattle savers, we've got help. Got issues. Gonna be cancer, isn't it? This means for you a cough, what, it's just like the flu? Uh... Aha! Uh -huh. The Emperor is helping us out. We're referring to him as THE Emperor, but we're going to be THE Emperor. This guy's just an important. <laughs> uh, you want it? Okay, fine. As long as you know what you're doing, our cat is helping us out. We've got help there. So if our court chaplain, who's the Prince Archbishop Wimarano, the Just of Valencia, I guess, He'll treat us well with some decent stuff. Stop, please. Lack of power. Aha. Uh -huh. There we go. So, it doesn't matter that this guy's a bastard. He'll just... He, we, we know who his father is, so that matters. It doesn't matter if he's legit, legitimized or not. And uh, there we go. We've got a nephew who is a Saeed. We'll call him... No, no. Athana Gildo? Gundamar? Petro? Beatnand? Or Dono? Hmm. <laughs> Let's go for Verimondo. Alright, fine. There you go. Uh, huh, we've got another kid on the road, on the way. Uh, you know what? I'll release you for six opinion everywhere. Stop! Damn it. Ah, there we go. <laughs> He's taking attrition, of course. Let's head over here. Oh. We'll land here. We'll, we'll not just drop ourselves on top of them. We'll get some morale back. In fact, what is... We've got the Renowned Spear of the Cross, of course. Uh, Visigothic Armor, that could be better. Or whatever. We don't need to spend money to create better stuff. We'll wait until we are... Oh, we've become a flanker as well. Alright, cool. We got tech. And we crush these guys. As expected. 
We're probably getting raided somewhere, this always happens. Who are you? I don't think we care about it anymore. Didn't we press a claim? Yes, I think we did. Who are you? Right, you've got no family and you've got some money, so when you die, we get your stuff. Who's this? Uh, let's just wake her up. Uh, I think no nothing of it. She's broke. Useless. Uh, secluded pants. Again. Alright. Fine. <laughs> let's try and get that erudite tray again. So we can't lead troops right now, though. So... Take a vow of celibacy. We don't need to do that. Expel... Did we massalize one of these people? Did we? All oh, right, we can raise these as well. We don't really need to. Yeah. I'm his liege. Our son is ill. Send him into hiding. He's ill. <laughs> Who is... What? <laughs> what is this? How dare you? There you go. Excuse me. You didn't look like someone that's capable of murder, but I suppose you could do it. I'm your heir. Brother, just stop. You'd be like, oh, okay. I tried to murder your son. Forgive me. In fact, this list is too long. Let's just auto stop it. Let's prune the list. Put over there. Uh, let's replace myself with someone. This guy, I guess. Alright, let's get the trait. Yeah, we did it. So we're fairly smart now. We've lost some ability to fight, though, because of that. We're stressed and we're, we've got pneumonia. Uh, oh dear. <laughs> so did our son, but he died. What a waste of money. We baptized him. Anyway, uh, our brother is now next to the line. I bet he's happy about this. We are no longer cruel. We captured some guy. We can humiliate him or we can ransom him for some meager amount of money. Oh god, did we just take a ton of attrition there? I think we did. We've got a new heir. Oh no, never mind. We replaced him. He's sickly. Damn it. Stop being sickly. Should we name him Modona as well? <laughs> He's the replacement. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the other one was defective. We've got a new one. Uh, but he seems defective as well. Come on, save him. I'm no, At least I'm kind of safer now. Alright, we're going to waste some more money on this kid. Alright, baptize him. Oh, he's left-handed as well. This would be great. He'll get extra combat skills. Uh, who can be his godfather? My brother, I guess. He really likes us by a lot. The guy that tried to... No, the, the guy that tried to kill his, my other son. <laughs> oh, this guy. This dull crusader. Or my sister. Hmm. Go for my brother. Whatever. Oh, priceless sight. Priceless? It cost me 500 gold. Well, actually, well, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Plus one health. All right. Don't die. All right. Oh, what's this? Is that, what is this? This is not part of the, who are you? Why are you here? You're not even trying to attack me. What is this? You're supposed to be attacking the Umayyads. Why are you here? You're kind of lost. Get out of here. No. Oh. Oh. I'm going to boat bomb there. Die. Oh, I mangled some guy. Or was it someone else? Well, whatever happened, this guy got mangled. Um, perhaps the merriment is a bit too much, as the spear is carelessly hurled into the field and someone is still out there, measuring the distance of the previous throw. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> At least he knows how, how far that guy threw it. There you go. 
And some other guy won this guy. Hmm. You honor me. Alright, cool. We're taking attrition stuff. Let's get on the boat. We, we've become raw. Rightly so, because these guys are trying to take our stuff. We're no longer raw. Never mind, we got over it. <laughs> I can lead troops now. Let's lead troops. Give our men a morale boost. We've got heirs and brothers and stuff. It doesn't matter if we suffer a few deaths. Alright, we can become patient. Yes, patient is better for leading troops. Defense plus 20. Let's do it. Beat these guys up. Get out of here. Our steward is gone. Who was... Who was our steward, even? Let's just get our court tutor. Our bastard court tutor to administer the realm. Or this guy. This guy. Because the court tutor is likely to lose traits every so often because of, you know, out of patience and stressed and whatever. So let's just continue sitting here waiting for these guys. By the time this jihad is over, uh, who's this? Some person. Some celibate person. What do you get? Damage against religious enemies. Can we get this in our line? <laughs> Try and steal it, get double the damage to enemies. We converted a uh, county. So yeah, this should happen a little quicker. Let's just get rid of this stuff up here. This should happen a little quicker. Because we have the bloodline now. Damn it. Uh, Pietro. Alright, sure. Train my commanders. Make awesome commanders. Get me new ones. Alright, you converted some guy. I don't really care. Some Suebi. Now Christian. Uh, our... Oh, wait. Our former... Vassal has become uh, beefied. Alright. The Gentle. This is the most terrible Jihad ever. <laughs> so, what? These guys are really ambitious. They're like, ah, take the fight to them. <laughs> uh, that's brilliant. All right, we've already converted that county. We can't even move him yet. Oh, never mind. We can. He's died. Good. Good timing. All right. Uh, let's. This guy like really loves me, except he really does not like that I've had a short reign. Or whatever. This guy wants to become a counselor, and he has one more. Oh God. There we go. We're getting raided. Alright, get on the boat. The Knights Hospitaler, or whoever those were. <laughs> they've, they've taken the fight all the way to, um, well, was it Sistan? And they're like, this this is a, <laughs> a really terrible jihad. They're sieging their own holdings back all the way in Sistan. Alright. Uh, oh, I'm no longer diligent. Terrible. I could get it back though if I reach the final um, level rank. Oh, we converted more stuff. This is going really quick. I guess we've got a hundred. Yeah, moral authority. Naturally, we can become zealous. Ah, the local Saint Ondor. Right, we've got a burial site for our father here now. So, the vault risk goes way down. Tax increment goes up. This is permanent. That's nice. Um, it was an inspiration in many ways, and I wish I could live up to him. Lately, I've visited his tomb a lot, and listened to the tales of his miracles throughout his life. Alright. Results. Alright, we've got a new commander. We'll just wait here. Everyone's just chilling out here. Nothing happening. Easiest war ever. And the Knights Hospital is fighting for their lives over here. But they're actually having an easy time as well. Alright. 
We don't actually gain too much out of winning Jihan, so it's kind of... I mean, okay, we get some gold. IT, moral authority, actually goes up a lot for 20 years. That is pretty good. Alright. Pathetic. Well. Alright, this content, kind, honest guy. Our Prince Archbishop Friedland. And be the court physician. Let's give our cousin some titles. Our Let's give the Seneschal title to our um, Grand Mayor. Our Merchant Republic Cupbearer, some kid. And High Almoner to the Duchess of Portugal. Alright. Alright, Ubinyans. Umayans. Um, let's put these down. Still quite a while. We'll start preparing in 973. I think it takes two years to do the whole uh, rally your troops by doing this. So we will wait two more years. There's nothing else we can really do. Hold a summer fair, sure, let's do it. Let's pay some money, get some prestige. We're over the 2,000 uh, threshold for various things, so these guys should like us for piety plus 10, and these guys, the feudal vassals, should like us for plus 10 because of prestige. Alright, so our courtier, a hunter whose patient can be a flanker, I guess. Flat terrain expert. Um, did he get it? What? Was that chance based or something? I don't know, whatever. Uh, the striding players had set up the scene, and we were rehearsing the lines for tonight. Uh, oh, and we we're ready. Let's start again. The strolling players had set up their scene and were rehearsing their lines for tonight's performance at the summer fair when I approached them. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, we can get a learning out of this. Theatre is a reflection of the world. Or we can tell them to play the Crusader Kings. Uh, no. It's become less dumb. Yeah. So we're pretty decent now. We've had fun as well. Maybe we could become just as well if one of our vassals decides to stab a servant at the feast. Secluded penance. Uh, what? <laughs> yeah, wait, hang on. Not yet. Wait, what's going on here? Wait a minute, what? What is this? <laughs> Novgorod. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> some su some sewer Minusco guy is in charge now. <laughs> what? You're a little far away from where you're supposed to be. Actually, no, I guess it's, it's this region here. I always feel like they should be like way over there. Orthodox, huh? These guys. Converted. That's uh, interesting. But this is kind of awkward. <laughs> He's hating life. Oh, you people. <laughs> what have you done to our great conquest from whoever did it? I think... Yeah, he did it. He had... Because he, he won two crusades, that's why he got the crusade of blood. Uh, yeah. Squandering the saints' achievements. Oh, wait. Beast. All my vassals would be there. Alright, let's... Uh, we can't afford another Caballeros retinue. We can hand out something. Court Physician. People are dying all the time. A shrewd, zealous, fat kind. Yeah, let's make our Grand Mayor our Court Physician. Why not? You totally have the time for that, right? <laughs> um, yeah, let's hire some bunch of people to perform at our feast. 
oh, we can question this pact or whatever. Why have we even got a pact? What's... Marriage between Prince Swamia and Elvira. Who was that again? I completely forgotten. Right, this one. My sister, who is in hiding. Uh, well, because she's got a difficult pregnancy. Um, and the prince over here. His son. Alright, so we're gonna maybe lose prestige here or something. Okay, you guys can't arrive at the feast. So he's gonna now say no, or yeah, or whatever. You'd be like, I must say I do not approve of Tony in your ass letter. Mm. We don't really care about you. <laughs> what are you actually doing though? What is your realm like? I guess he'd be an interesting ally. Should we just try and appease him? I mean, we don't care about prestige. We're getting 13 per month. That is pretty good. Wait, wait. He wants an alliance. Let's see what dumb wars he can drag us into. Let's just do it. Hmm. <laughs> He's already broken. <laughs> and he instantly breaks it. Oh, why? This is so dumb. Lamentably, your words of apology do not ring true. Alright, fine, whatever. Shortest lives alliance ever. It's like both letters were in transit. Um. All right, let's just press all claim. Right, I've got claims on the places as well. Yeah. So what is this actually? Defending against Yar, Balder, the Evils, Cumbrian prepared invasion of Astorias. Whatever, we'll just let him win then, I guess. <laughs> we'll holy war this guy for it. Who's this guy anyway? Is he a vassal to someone? He's in a revolt? We're going to go to war with England, perhaps. Because if I attack for my claims, I don't think I become hostile towards the guy doing the prepared invasion because it's not technically the same CB. Oh, he's losing. Look at that. Right, France is here to uh, save the day. Frankia, even. We'll wait until all that is settled, because he's probably going to attach himself to that army, and then we're going to have to fight all of Frankia as well. All right, more people are getting blessed and, and stuff. Seems to be happening a lot more now. You can see here, it's four saints. Uh, we've got another kid on the way. Spy master. Ooh, powerful vassal. He already likes us by a hundred though. Right, it's, uh, it's our brother. I don't know if... <laughs> I don't know if we want to make our brother a spy master. That does not seem like the smart move to do. Because he's likely to just try and fabricate himself to be next in line. Uh, let's just find some genius guy here. Alright, you can be the genius spy master. Sardinian orthodox guy. Uh, yep, that's you. Spy on Constantinople. We'll just keep an eye on this. What's this? Conquest of Skag. He's 
mean, <laughs> like, these guys have been in nothing but defensive wars since they received that land. Right, we need to, to do this secluded dependence thing. All right, fine. And it's 973. All right. Are you even still the same guy? Yes, you are. You're messed up, though. All right. We'll hit the button. Abiria belongs to Christianity. There we go. All right. We'll declare war on them soon enough after we've got some troops. We don't even need to. We're making a lot of money though, so uh, it's always the same cost, right? Or is it scaled? No, it's the same cost. To everything I have. Yeah, sure. We'll just ask the Pope for more money. Or is it scaled? I think it might be. I can't remember. How much did we pay before for the most expensive thing? Uh, we got promoted, of course. Oh, can we move this guy? We'll figure this out. We are small. Uh oh. Alright, Siljuk is here. Hadi Shah Siljuk, the conqueror of the Siljuk. Uh, Siljuk, Siljuk. <laughs> Siljuk, damn it. Alright, Turkish Khans come and go. Alright, so this will uh, spice things up over here. We've become humble as well. And I think we're going to leave it at that for now. But. Have a look here, Songhai. Maybe we'll start spamming that guy with uh, missionaries or something, try and convert them. Just because we can. Vladimir. Got Novgorod going crazy. Conquering the coasts. Uh, Frankia's. Just blobbing. Oh, everything's on fire here. You're getting raided by stuff. Who are you getting raided by? Nomads? Or just random Vikings walking way inland to raid stuff. I hate those armies. The ones that don't need a boat, like adventurer raiders that just run on all the way and start raiding in the middle of Frankia or something. It's just like absurd. They should stick to the coast just like normal raiders, I think. It's just ah, it's annoying. Like what are they gonna do? Wheel all the stuff that they get back without a boat? <laughs> uh whatever. Alright, so uh See you in the next one.